Good morning, dear students. Today we shall learn to measure a given angle by protector. So here we are having one angle. The two rays O A and O B are meeting at O. So we are having an angle A O B or B O A. Now we have to measure the angle. How much is this angle? We have to measure. How to do that? Do that. As we have discussed earlier, the vertex, that means the meeting point of the rays O A and O B, they are meeting at point. O, they are intersecting at point O. So this middle point of the protector, this middle point of the protector will be placed over O. It is placed over O. Then this uh, black dark line it should come on OB, it should match with the line OB. Then count the angles, count the angles 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Then we can see that it is up to scale 55. It is middle of 60 and 50 so it is 55 degree so this is how you can have to measure any angle given angle I'll show one more for you I'll do one more for you suppose I am having an angle I'm having an angle here um, I am having this angle like this. The two rays are meeting at O. Suppose this is P and this is Q. Now we have to measure the angle. How to measure the angle? Again this middle point it will come over O. Overlap the dark line with OP this dark line which uh, the scale begins with 0 degree that will come over the uh, line so from 0 we can measure that from from 0 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 110, 120, 130 and this is 140 so the measure of my angle I am going in this way so my arrow mark will be like this it is 140 degree angle like this you have to draw uh, or you have to measure um, the given angles in your exam, uh, I will not give you to measure angles, but you have to draw, uh, suppose, 60 degree angle or 90 degree angle, 135 degree angle, 120 degree angle. You practice at home how to draw the angles with protector and ruler. So, now we shall see different types of angles. I have drawn one line. I have drawn a 90 degree angle over the line. So this is 90 degree. You can see here also in this side it is 90 degree same same value. If I just go to the opposite side of the line here also it is 90 degree and here it is 90 degree. So now 
starting from zero up to this point it is 90 degree from 90 to this it is 180 degree in the scale in the protector from 180 degree to this side opposite side we have got this 90 degree 180 plus 90 it is 270 degree up to this it is 270 degree from 270 degree again 90 degree this 90 degree so it is 270 plus 90 that is 360 degree from this to this 90 from this to this 180 from this to this 270 from this to this again we have reached the original point starting from point so here it is 360 degree it is one complete circle so 360 degree is called complete angle it is complete angle because if we go one round we reach the original position or the starting point so it is complete angle this is one straight line this is one straight line starting from 0 to 90 degree 90 to 180 degree so 0 to 180 degree is a straight line so 180 degree is called straight angle you remember that straight angle from 0 to 90 degree these angles are called acute angles all the angles between 0 and 90 degree are called acute angles from 90 degree to 100 degree those are obtuse angles obtuse angles from 180 degree to 360 degree from this to this from 180 degree to 360 degree 180 degree to 360 degree these are called reflex angles so this 180 to 360 degree this range is called reflex angle so if I give you a list and find out the different types of angles, I hope you will be able to do so. Here when the two rays are in the same line, suppose it means if the two lines are on the same line, we are not moving anywhere, we are here only in zero only, that is called a zero degree angle. If we are not moving up, uh, that means uh, with this line only we are uh, measuring the angle not going anywhere so it is it will be zero degree angle because there will be there is uh, no angle formation so it is zero degree I hope you have understood this um, you just note down this um, in your copy so that you can solve the MCQs and some short questions based on this. Here I have given to make a list of angles. First angle is 269.5 degree. 269.5 It is between 180 and 360 degree so it is reflex angle 127 degree it is uh, less than it is less than 180 degree so it is um, obtuse angle obtuse angle 0 degree is 0 degree only 0 degree angle 360 is a complete angle 
just now I have explained complete angle 45 degree is less than 90 degree it is less than 90 degree so it is acute angle then 163 degree is less than 180 degree less than 180 degree means obtuse angle and 210 <clears throat> this is a greater than 180 less than 360 so it is a reflex angle so like this you have to make table of different angles in your um, exam I have given this type of questions so practice if you don't understand follow the video one more time these are very easy con concept so if you have any doubt just ask me for a clarification again I am repeating 269.5 it is lying lying between 180 and 360 so it is reflex angle 127 is less than 180 degree but greater than 90 degree so it is obtuse angle 0 degree is 0 degree angle 360 degree is a complete angle 360 degree 45 degree is less than 90 degree so it is acute angle 163 degree is less than 180 but greater than 90 degree so it is obtuse angle and 210 is greater than 180 but less than 360 so it is reflex angle like this you have to write in your exam